Welcome to my channel. In this video, I will be showing you solutions to problems related to farm machinery and mechanization. But before that, please consider subscribing and clicking the notification bell to support my channel grow. This time, we will be solving this problem. A farmer wishes to spray his vegetable farm at a rate of 300 gallons per hectare. 16 nozzles, 18 inches apart will be used. The forward speed of the tractor will be 5 km per hour. To begin with, let us first identify our given. We have the spray rate of 300 gallons per hectare. The number of nozzles to be 16. The nozzle spacing to 18 inches per nozzle. And the speed of 5 km per hour. The required are the field capacity and the pump capacity. The first value that we are going to solve is the field capacity. The formula to solve its value is Fc is equal to S multiplied to W all over 10. Wherein, Fc is the field capacity. S is the speed in kilometers per hour, and W is the width in meters. We already have the values needed in the equation so simply substitute. Giving S, speed of 5 kilometers per hour, multiplied to the width. The width can be obtained by multiplying the number of nozzles to the nozzle spacing, which is 16 nozzle times 18 inches per nozzle. We have to convert inches to meter using the conversion factor, 1 inch is equal to 0.0254 meters. All over 10. We simply solve and we have, the speed of 5 km per hour times the width of 7.3152 meters, all over 10. We have a final value for our field capacity to be 3.6576 hectare per hour. The next value we are going to solve is the pump capacity. It can be solved by multiplying FC to Q, where FC is the field capacity and the Q is the spray rate. We simply substitute the values in the equation because we already identify them. We have field capacity of 3.6576 hectare per hour. We need to convert hour to minutes using the conversion factor. One hour is equal to 60 minutes. Multiplied to the spray rate of 300 gallons per hectare. We simply solve and we have a final value for our pump capacity to be 18.288 gallons per minute. That is now the solution to our problem. If you wish to watch more tutorials related to this field, you can simply visit my channel. Don't forget to like and subscribe before you exit. Thank you for your support.